y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome to my basement on this day of days. It is here, the season three finale, also the series finale of Deadwood. I can't believe we're here. This was gonna be a short little, boop, 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 boop. feels like it's taking forever, yet it also feels as if we just started. And I don't know what to expect from this episode because I know it's not going to be a satisfying series finale because they didn't know if that's what it was going to be. And we're fortunate enough to have the movie. So I'm hoping that this is at least a satisfying season three finale. Ellsworth was done dirty. He was done dirty. And what was with parading his body through town? Whose idea was that? Was it the wagon guys? Was it somebody at the mine who, you couldn't have put a sheet over the man as you strolled him through town. What the hell? Wu was off getting more men, however long it takes for them to come to town. I don't know. Battle is a brewing. Battle's a brewing. Trixie, that's right. Trixie, Trixie, <laughs> Trixie went, fuck it. Took a shot at hers. I don't know what was off with her aim. She was, she was about as far away as this camera. <laughs> and she still how someone only winged the guy in the, not shoulder, chest up here. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what kind of repercussions will come about, but I am excited to find out. And I'm also glad that you are here with me, especially if you've been with me through the whole journey. So let's get in, get bundled. It's snowing outside, so it's freezing in the basement. Thanks again for being with me, and let's get to it. Casket's calling your name on it. Body's inside. Evidently not mine. Is it Odell's body? I don't like your tone of voice. Who are you, Mr. Utter, for me to care what you like or don't? I'm the guy that the next time you see me, you better take a different fucking tone with. <laughs> Does he know who's inside? What's the point, Al, having us leave IOUs when Wu can't read fucking English? Wu gets back, he'll take Al the IOUs for interpreting and find out Al did the rightful thing while he was gone. And he ain't lying, Al's the most honorable man you'll ever meet. <laughs> Johnny, what are you gonna do? Is that Hawkeye? Murder. Lots of cheats in that mess up there. Is there a railroad coming to camp? Are Wu's men there already? We are to sell, Sophia, so that we may stay. To be fair to Mr. Hurst, which is more than he deserves. As a practical matter makes refusal absurd. But how I hate to give that man what he wants. Mm, poor Sophia's hair is too. hair has survived my <laughs> diet Getting it out on Oh, Alma's black dress has seen a lot, a lot of action. Advancing your interests, Mrs. Ellsworth, what we do here seems natural and proper. Mr. Newman, ready payment to the officers of Mrs. Ellsworth's bank. We'll receive it where we can put it in her safe. Madam, you do not subscribe to this insulting and juvenile precaution yes she does i do not find the precaution juvenile. considering you murdered my husband i acknowledge the pretense to civility in a man so brutally vicious as vapid and grotesque <laughs> have the gold seen to her bank newman when that tedium is completed, have the documents witnessed as though we were all of us Jews. Excuse my absence, Mr. Starr, as I hope you'll forgive my thoughtless aspersion on your race. No. You've changed your sense. Can't shut up. Every bully I ever met 
can't shut his fucking mouth. Mm -hmm. Does he really think people look upon him as if he's some like benevolent business owner and not the asshole that he is? What is it, Mr. Hurst? May I look at the addressee? How will you know to whom it is to be delivered if you do not? Oh, dear. Oh, and Steve's still hanging around. Wow. When you declared for sheriff, Harry, I feared you'd be a poor campaigner and derelict in your duties here. You've held your end up and more. Seth can barely keep Deadwood <laughs> in order. That much space, that much space for a sheriff. I don't, I don't get that. Why wouldn't Sturgis have its own sheriff and so on? The Finster Model 60 Steam Pumper Fire Wagon. 120 gallon boiler. Three brass nozzles. Doesn't Deadwood burn down at some point in history? Aroundabouts there? Did the hats come? Where are you going? Take him to vote for Bullock. This may require my supervision. You don't expect me to believe you didn't steam this open. I didn't want to know. It's awfully big script. This motherfucker. For my complicity in his shooting, he orders my death. You did read it. <gasps> your complicity is mostly in your noggin, E.B. It's the whore he once did. <gasps> oh, no. Did he send for you, Joni? Well, not knowing Mr. Tolliver's uh, present state of feeling towards you is why I ask. Then why don't you stay the fuck out of it, Con? I wasn't fucking dreaming. It is Joni Stubbs. I got to stay the fuck out written on a stone tablet in my bedroom. <laughs> that whore's got to die. Jen? Hearst won't stand for an empty coffin. Likely he paid most attention to Trixie's tits and snatch. He's gonna switch out, girls. What? You like her. But she's a nice girl. What? She's learning to read. Oh. Spend some time with her and let me know when you're done. Oh, he's making Johnny do it. <laughs> give me the fucking knife then. Just give me the fucking knife. Oh, this isn't right. This isn't right at all. What are you doing? Going for a stroll to the polls. One vote for Star buys a hand job. Repeaters get a suck. Trixie. I'm through staying inside. If something's to happen, let it happen to me. <laughs> I'm not fucking afraid. I guess maybe I'm not either. Not to die. Why you? bother with your boots then, Trixie, if you're going to be let at your knees? Let go of me! No! Let me walk down myself! The fuck if I will! At least I can say I threw you out if you'd rather die than live with me! Better look twice before opening that door. It might not be her. I'm looking for assassins around every corner. <laughs> Use just half to you see how you stand it. I want to talk with you. No, I mean it, I want to talk. <laughs> Pure conversation. Nothing for you to be alarmed about. So why Jen, when that other girl looked fairly similar to Jen, just shorter? I got a whole operation. This is, terrible. This is so, so, so bad. This is so terrible, and I can't believe you made Johnny do it. Everyone's got a task to hew to, Jen. You understand me? We'll talk about this later. I won't let you pass, boss. Johnny. Huh? I won't let you. You're willing to die in her stead? If I got to. Uh, Johnny? Preferring you'd handle things different. Because if you die, she's dead anyway. 
Make sure the whore don't leave. Let Johnny cool down, then knock him the fuck out. Is I'm gonna go look and see if, perchance, I mightn't be the owner of another fucking knife. I was wondering about that when Johnny said, give me the knife. <laughs> right to vote shall not be abridged or denied on account of race or color, condition of previous servitude. 15th Amendment to the U.S. Constitution. Then I guess you want this white man voting first. What's a few minutes more? The nigger was before here. No, he wasn't. I guess you're blind and stupid. I believe I'll vote later. Fuck if you will. Get your nigger ass back in line. <laughs> you better be walking him home afterwards. You better see to that yourself. Because if he don't make it, you'll be eating your spuds running till I hunt you the fuck down. And that ends that. Or you drop your fucking ballot. <laughs> Charlie's having none of it today. She thinks Hurst is going to want her dead. She thinks you'll kill one of these others. Jesus Christ. <laughs> she was right. <laughs> I already fucking did. <laughs> and after you tell fucking Hurst, before you tell that loudmouth cunt, tell your fucking partner I need him here. Don't talk about her that Oh, I fucking recant. Off you fucking go. <laughs> but don't neglect fucking Bullock. Water comes to a boil. Why? Okay, wait. So, wait. He had salt. Salt. Salt tell her. How many atoms of the promise 23? Almost 18, Mr. Swearingen. What does he mean by almost 18? <laughs> 17 normal size and a short one that's held with a knife. <laughs> Turn me loose. <laughs> Same word your physician with the midget. That went off well. <laughs> this is... Oh, sheesh kebabs. Why is Jean fucked up? What happened, Jane? The bank lady took her child elsewhere at grave, and I got drunk. He sent us this. <gasps> Bill's this coat! Bill Hickok's robe you got there. But I would have Mr. Swearingen understand that I ought to see that the whore has paid with her own. You'll go there? Of course. I feel very safe in this camp. He shouldn't. Every fucking time I walk by, oh, how could you? How could you with those big fucking cow eyes? He's talking to the chief. I should have fucking learned to use a gun, but I'm too <laughs> fucking entrenched in my ways. <laughs> so did he kill someone? Or was he planning on it? Come here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Bye, Jen. It mm. seemed like Hurst ordered the interference. Being stupid on his own, that strong arm was. Well, if you didn't want, I could say yes. I'm sorry for barging in. What is it, Saul? Everything. <laughs> oh. Whilst imagining for you, Mr. Hurst, the Earth entertaining some larger purpose. To be told you elsewhere and at another time. Was Langrish trying to get him to leave? Why do you say so? In those words, I mean, the earth speaks. <laughs> Sturgis has a landslide for Harry Manning. 970 Ooh, votes really? for Harry Manning, 68 votes for Mr. Bullock. Ooh. Ooh. How do you think you might enjoy? Private life. Sturgis. <laughs> put her in. Don't I want to put my dress on her first, you fucking moron? What guilt this must be for her. Oh my god. We show United in the prelude when he's making his entrance and the fucking like. Comes to view in the body. I stand for virtue alone. The deception failing, I'll make a pass at him with my blade. Wow. In the aftermath, play the lie is mine, knowing I speak of you in heaven. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, ow. Wow. 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 Oh. Last two or three days been good. What? What is what is Bru Bruin here? Bruin me up to be with you. <gasps> what is happening here? What is happening? What the fuck did you do to me, sir? I believe I fucking stabbed you. Right in the artery. What is what what what? Are you here to confirm a croaker? In here? Hershnoops is operating headquarters to lead. I get to see to all is other than mining interests here in the camp. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, Leon. Oh. I'd take that fucking scrub brush. If I'm quick enough about this, Janine, maybe me and Mr. Hurst will get to hear the Lord Judge Leon. Seth? Huh? <gasps> what? Charlie. What is happening? You looked at your last body. You're done tipping your fucking hat. Get out of here. Or I'll drag you out by the ear. <gasps> Please don't. Drive on. What is I doing? What is Sai doing? Did she suffer? I was gentle as I was able, and that's the last we'll fucking speak of it, Johnny. Is he gonna cast Johnny away now? Wants me to tell him something pretty. That was a satisfying season finale. Because I don't think any there was <laughs> I'm working, my head's working hard. You can see it, you can see it. The elections are still going on. Seth lost in Sturgis, but we don't know what's happened with the rest of the county. And is Deadwood and Sturgis the only parts of the county? Hearst decides to leave because he wants to go find more stuff. Copper in Montana. But he bought Alma's claim, which blows. Blows. And he left it for Sideron and Newman? Psy. Psy. To do what exactly? Because I thought he said non-mining business. So what's the non-mining business? Just keeping whoever works there? Uh, and why was Sai having such an issue? He put himself in Hearst's pocket the moment Hearst walked into town. He killed Leon just because he's pissed. So he's taking out on Leon. Leon. And he was going to shoot who? Seth? Hearst? Janine? But Janine, he turned on at the last second, and she held him off by flashing her boobs. See why I lost? Because that's what I saw with my eyeballs. I don't know what I was supposed to see. <laughs> and Hurst goes off thinking that his 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 business will just be tended to. Okay, okay, and so, <laughs> but we got all of Wu's guys there. We got Hawkeye with his guys there. To do what were they supposed to be there in case Hearst men started something? Was that their was that their purpose? But they didn't. And the reason I'm extra squinty eyed is because I believe the movie takes place in ten years, ten years from the end of season three. So all the stuff, these little bits that were building up. <laughs> They're not going to be around in 10 years. Because again, this is not like... 
That time is not like it is now, where you can instantly communicate with someone, where if you had businesses in different parts of the country, you could call somebody up, you can fly within hours and physically see, impose your will on what your workers to appoint. Back here, they, they couldn't. So her's just thinking someone's gonna follow through. Close my mind. <laughs> So it's election day, finally, and I don't know who officially won. I'm guessing Seth didn't, and that's why he goes builds his hotel. That's what he really does, I believe. <laughs> Happy endings? No, it's just a lot of questions on what's going to happen next. So I'm so glad that they have the movie, because I hope that wraps up some things. And I hope that you are there with me when I do watch it. Will it, it will be sometime in the nearest future, maybe not this week. It's holiday weekend. I don't know when you're watching this video, but it's coming up to Christmas week in my time. So lots of stuff's going on, but I do hope to have it out before New Year's and I want you there with me. So thank you so much for being with me for these three seasons so far. It has meant a lot. I hope you hit subscribe and I hope you come back and see me in the next video in the queue. So thanks again, you all, and until next time.